Yeah, so I was thinking, um, it's starting to snow and um, this might be the last chance to make some predictions that it's possible that the um, Ottawa LRT may not function properly under heavy uh, snowfall. And I guess it's probably going to just do whatever it did during testing, but one of the main problems is um, some of these um, grades, the, uh, that is the, um, the angle at which these tracks are, are not really conducive to uh, having trains on them because trains have a tendency to slide backwards. So under situations with a good amount of uh, friction, um, or sorry, a good amount of um, stuff on the track, they might uh, start sliding backwards, um, be having less friction than um, ordinarily so. So um, if that is the case, um, you know, you, you'd be looking at it, it needing um, either things to help it work or uh, some sort of covering over the, the exposed areas to, to function properly. So um, let's take a look here. Um, let's see, um, core, um, corrugated uh, steel, um, salt, um, shit. Okay. There we go. So uh, let's take a look here at images. Da -da -da -da. This looks good. You can have something like this here. Something like this over the entire thing, put like windows on it. And then it would have to handle the snowfall, for example. I mean, that's one way you could solve that. But it's true that it might just work. I mean, I heard somebody say that it had to do with uh, sensors, that it wasn't working. So that wouldn't be a problem with uh, the friction to the track. But um, it's very likely it'll screw up and then they would have to uh, basically use buses. Uh, and then, you know, I just hope that this doesn't go on for a long time and there's like, um, you know, we wind up with higher property taxes. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Yeah, another sort of problem is like, um, uh, if there's like a water main breaks or something and you're like in the deepest part of the, the tunnel and it like floods and like, you know, we like drown. But um, I guess um, that could have been solved by lining the entire tunnel with some sort of waterproof barrier. And also, um, you know, there might be some drainage or some pumps to, to take care of that. But uh, that would be like a really bad scenario. So, you know, I was a little bit worried about that.